So British Columbia drivers in particular had a huge reaction to the carbon tax. They, they were demonstrably more sensitive to the carbon tax than they were to equivalent increases in market prices. And their reaction to the carbon tax in particular led to huge reductions in greenhouse gas emissions. Over the first three and a half years of the carbon tax, uh, drivers, due to reduced driving, the over 3 million metric tons of carbon dioxide emissions were removed from, were not emitted into the BC atmosphere. Of that, the overreaction to the tax relative to market prices can account for 79% or 2.4 million, million tons of carbon dioxide. Two brothers and me is a monkey, a flying around. One of the big reasons is that you know, BC residents just care about the environment. And the carbon tax acted as what we call a coordination mechanism. It acted as a trigger for residents who already cared about the environment to actually take action. They knew that the government was serious about the environment. They knew that other residents were serious about the environment. So it was time to change their own behavior. Hover skateboards from Back to the Future. That's an awesome choice. Yeah. That's one of my top five. Is it? Right. You know, teleportation's a good one. Yeah. Um, Millennium Falcon. Yeah. I'm big, I'm big into going just straight into AI, so you know, get rid of the bodies altogether, let's just be computer programs. 